been one month since an Amber Alert case turned into a homicide investigation in Wilmer. Police say Juan Aguilar Cano killed Zuleika Lopez and then fled to Mexico after abducting 10-year-old Ian Aguilar. Although Ian has been reunited with his family locally, he and his siblings no longer have their mother. As Matt Howerton shows us, tonight Zuleika's daughter is begging for justice. I never thought I would have custody of my 10 year old brother. Zuri Lopez is filling some big shoes. Love him to death, but it's, um, it's you know, kind of hard to get used to. She's now raising her 10 year old half brother, Ian Aguilar, after he was safely brought back to the States from Mexico. The man who took him there, his father, Juan Aguilar Cano, is still at large somewhere in the country. I need him back here to answer for what he did. On November 14th, police say Aguilar Cano killed Ian's mother, Zuleika Lopez, at their home in Wilmer, then took the boy south where they hopped on a bus to Mexico. Ian was left with family there while Aguilar Cano disappeared. I was really happy, but at the same time, I was very overwhelmed and sad because he didn't really know what had happened. A family member drove into Dolores Hidalgo to get Ian and bring him back. The whole time, Lopez says, he was unaware his mother was gone. I don't understand how he could do this to him of all people. The U.S. Marshal Service working to find Aguilar Cano, but so far no substantial updates. Finding a fugitive in Mexico isn't exactly simple. Patience. Gabby Petito and all these big cases around the U.S. and everybody took those things seriously. And here I am. I feel kind of alone as far as like getting justice for my mom. Has been the hardest part for Lopez. She's sharing a new, more recent photo of Aguilar Cano in hopes someone in Mexico might recognize him. I just, I feel like I can't really heal until something is done. In Dallas, I'm Matt Howerton.